A University of Kansas athletic director Lou Perkins says he's the victim of a blackmail attempt. Well, this comes just after news of KU's ticket scalping scandal. Chris Hernandez talked with Perkins today. Chris? Elizabeth, news reports say a former employee wanted to get back at Perkins and had been riding back and forth with Perkins' attorney about $35,000 worth of exercise equipment. But Perkins went to police about a month ago after it turned into an alleged blackmail threat against Perkins. KU's athletic director says he's trying to get some work done at the Big 12's meetings in Kansas City this week. But after dealing with the ticket office investigation, now Perkins says a former employee tried to blackmail him. The word victim. I'm the victim. I turned everything over to the police department. The story surfaced over the weekend. The AP and the Topeka Capital Journal reported that a disgruntled former employee allegedly tried to get money from Perkins in exchange for silence about an alleged swap of exercise equipment equipment for premium tickets. Um, Perkins refused to, to discuss it when I first asked him uh, early today. I got to go to another meeting, guys. What is your concern about the blackmail allegations coming out now? But a few hours later, Perkins called a news conference. I think it's very clear uh, uh, if you take some decent and logical thoughts, I think you can figure out what this is all about. Perkins says he'd like to get more off his chest, but says he can't because of the ongoing investigation. Reports have named the alleged blackmailer as William Dent. Dent was reportedly KU's director of sports medicine with a $100,000 a year job until 2007. Dent told the Capital Journal he wanted to, quote, force Perkins' hand. Chris Hernandez, NBC Action News.